There are now multiple January 6th defendants having pleaded guilty and having served time who have announced attempts to run for office, in some cases, high office. Take a look at this one. This is the filing in Arizona from Jacob Chansley in his pursuit of Arizona's 8th Congressional District seat as a libertarian. You may know Jacob Chansley better as the QAnon shaman, you know, with the horns and the fur here on January 6th. He's already served his time at a federal prison in Arizona and is now potentially seeking office. And there's Derek Evans of West Virginia who told me he was considering a run for office after having finished his brief prison term in his January 6th case. And it's far from clear what a connection to a January 6th case, what a guilty plea means in a primary with certain congressional district Republican bases or libertarian voters. Will it help? Will it hurt?